morning everyone today we are going to discuss about permanent magnet moving coil instrument that is pmmc instrument what is the construction why it is called pmmc instrument what are the errors present all this will be discussed in this session the instruments which uses the permanent magnet for creating the stationary magnetic field between which the coil moves is known as permanent magnet moving coil or pmmc instrument it operates on the principle of the torque is exerted on the moving coil placed in the magnetic field of the permanent magnet the pmmc instrument gives the accurate result for dc measurement the construction of pmmc instrument is as shown in figure the moving coil and permanent magnet are the main parts of the pmmc instrument the parts of the pmmc instruments are explained in detail in this video the major parts of pmmc instrument are permanent magnets core coil and pointer and scale the moving coil the coil is the current carrying part of the instrument which is freely moved between stationary field or permanent magnet the current passes through the coil deflects it due to the which the magnitude of the current or voltage is determined the coil is mounted on the rectangular former which is made up of aluminum the former increases the radial and uniform magnetic field between the air gap of the poles the coil is wound with silk cover copper wire between the poles of the magnet the coil is mounted on the rectangular former which is made up of aluminum the former increases the radial and uniform magnetic field between the air gap of the poles the coil is wound with the silk cover copper wire between the poles of magnet another important part in pmmc instrument is magnet system the pmmc instrument using the permanent magnet for creating the stationary magnetic field the alcomax and alnico are the materials used for creating the permanent magnet because this magnet has high coercive force what is meant by coercive force the coercive force changes the magnetization property of the magnet controlling part in pmmc instruments the controlling torque is produced by the two springs attached to the spindle the springs are made up of phosphorus bronze and placed between two jeweled bearings the springs also produce the spring also provides the path to the lead current to flow in and out of the moving coil that means the total current will be enters through the spring and leaves through the spring the controlling torque is mainly because of suspension of the ribbon for every instrument they require deflecting torque controlling torque and damping torque the deflecting torque is produced in the coil whereas controlling torque is produced by controlling spring and damping system is present to reduce damping or oscillations the damping torque is used for keeping the moment of the coil in rest the damping torque is induced because of moment of the aluminum core which is moving between the poles of the permanent magnet which type of damping we are using in pmmc instrument is eddy current damping there are so many methods of damping one of the method is air friction damping fluid friction damping and eddy current damping in pmmc instrument it is possible to create eddy current damping the pointer and scales are the parts of the pmmc instrument the pointer is linked with the moving coil the pointer is attached to the spindle of the moving coil the pointer notices the deflection of the coil 
and the magnitude of the deviation is shown in the scale. The pointer is made of lightweight material and hence it is easily deflected with the movement of the coil. Sometimes the parallax error occurs in the instrument which is easily reduced by correctly aligning the blade of the pointer. What is the principle of PMMC instrument? The principle of working of PMMC instrument is similar to DC motor. When a current carrying conductor is placed in a magnetic field, it experiences a force and tends to move in the direction as per Fleming's left hand rule. The Fleming's left hand rule you know that when the first and second finger and thumb of the left hand are held so that they are at right angle to each other, then the thumb shows the direction of force on the conductor. The first finger points out the direction of magnetic field and the second finger shows the direction of current in the wire. The controlling torque is produced by controlling spring. This torque is produced by the spring action and opposes the deflection torque. So as the pointer came to rest at point where the two torques are equal. When the pointer is in stable condition, the two torques, that is deflection torque and controlling torque, both are equal. The value of controlling torque depends on mechanical design of spring. The controlling torque is directly proportional to the angle of deflection of the coil. The torque equation for PMMC instrument can be obtained from basic laws of electromagnetic laws. From Fleming's left hand rule, force is given by F equal to BIL sin theta newton. If theta equal to 90 degrees, assume that F equal to BIL Newton. We know that torque is the product of force and perpendicular distance. Therefore, deflecting torque or TD equal to BIL distance into number of turns. TD equal to BIL LDN. Where A equal to area, we can in place of A, L in product LD can be replaced by A. Therefore, Td equal to BIAN, where Td equal to deflecting torque in Newton meter, B is flux density in air gap, that is, uh, flux density unit is Weber per meter square, number of tons in coil N, A is the effective coil area in meter square, I is the current in moving coil in ampere. We know that uh, the constant uh, NBA is comes under one constant that the number of turns are fixed uh, that means constant flux density is constant and the area of cross section of the coil also constant in equation one if you put G uh, G as a NBA then TD equal to GA controlling spring and it is proportional to angular deflection as we discussed previously TC is proportional to theta TC equal to K theta we can write at a stable condition or equilibrium condition, both torques TD and TC are equal. If you substitute this BIAN equal to K theta, theta equal to theta equal to IZ by K, you will get the deflection. Deflection is proportional to current from that G by K is constant. If you take a theta equal to theta is proportional to current. In PMM's instrument, the deflection angle theta is proportional to current. Therefore, from that relation, we can say that the deflection is proportional to current, hence the permanent magnet moving coil instrument the scale is uniform or linear. That is one of the advantages of PMMC instrument. There are so many advantages. Scale is uniform, it is one of the advantages. Power consumption is low, that is 25 to 200 microwatts only. Sensitivity is high for DC measurements. That is the advantage. These are the advantages of PMMC instrument. Disadvantages of PMMC instruments are it is used for only DC measurements. The cost is high due to deflection. The cost is high due to delicate construction because of permanent magnets. All these. Aging of permanent magnet and springs introduce some error that is one of the disadvantages. So friends, na channel ni subscribe cheyadam chala easy. Kinda meeku subscribe button anni kinda kanipistundi kada red color lo subscribe button raseru. Aa button ni ila press cheyandi. 
subscribed and also not about the bell icon also in the the bell icon pina all and press and in in chase a video make a compulsory and notification girl was to the anti delay check on the mirror video to that show so in can the call us young please subscribe and press bell icon thank you don't forget to like the video thank you